We have this opportunity to really uncover the true identity of Burley. The surf, the waves, the water, the fishing. It really is one of the most unique natural places. When we were conceptualising the way the building would look and feel, we wanted people to feel connected with the landscape. But at the front of the building, it just opens up completely to the beach, so you're just looking straight at the white sands of Burley over the North Lake Pines. We have a concrete frame reflect the natural features of Burley itself, the sand, the waves, the headlands. It has a gentle sweep and a curve to it, almost like a fishing net. The apartments themselves are elevated up above the street. But the higher you go, you become more up in the sky overlooking beautiful Burley and back towards surface and down towards Coolangatta. We have this wellness centre, which is at the ground level. It's quite a private space. The scalloped edge of the pool opposes the scalloping of the building. So you have this ability to be under the shade or out in the sun and in the water. The concrete frame will screen from the sun, so you'll get some play between light and shadow along the edges of the building. You'll get some beautiful northern light into the apartment. I love creating spaces for people that makes their lives easier and better. The materials are quite warm in the tones that we use. We've got some beautiful natural materials such as marble, some porcelain and travertine. When you enter your apartment, you get a lovely little sunroom right in front of you and that sunroom is connected to the outside with a vertical garden. The kitchen is the feature element of the design. So we've highlighted the island bench as the hero by using marble, but also with some beautiful detailing where there's a curve. The bathrooms have been designed to provide quite a lot of layering. So we've got little mosaic tiles next to mirror and the vanity, which is a big marble block that's then installed onto it. The bath is a freestanding bath. We've connected the stone from the vanity and placed it back on the wall behind the bath. These mosaic tiles are then continued into the curved shower and the other amenity spaces. The balconies are spacious and the natural flow of the wind and air and sun would be lovely in that space. I think the greatest thing that you get out of being a landscape architect is seeing the enjoyment of people in the spaces. The theme at Natura is based on the adjacent headland of Burley Heads. We've looked at the textures and the forms of Burley Heads and we've utilised those within the entry and arrival spaces. The lobby has coastal landscape palette which includes cascading plants it's coming off the sides of the sort of cliff faces. The sky gardens are some vertical planting on each of the facade elements. A combination of succulent and cascading plant species contribute to a very strong green spine up the building. Burley headlands have rainforest in their proximity, so we've used some of those species and some of that connection in the southern and western landscape. The development offers this lush, tranquil feel and you feel as if you're entering into this connection to the basalt headland and to the rainforest. It's a very strong, welcoming element. <laughs>